everything you need to know about Need for Speed Unbound. Need for Speed Unbound Release Date Need for Speed Unbound will release on December 2, 2022, so there isn't long to wait until you can get behind the wheel. However, EA Play members will be able to jump into a free 10-hour trial of the game from November 29, 2022, a little earlier. This is a short turnaround. Two, the game was only unveiled at the start of October 2022, so EA must have had it under wraps for a while. Need for Speed Unbound Platforms Surprisingly, for such a big franchise, EA and developer Criterion are limiting where you can pick up Need for Speed Unbound, it's only coming out on newer platforms. You'll be able to play it on PS5, Xbox Series X slash S and PC, through a few different storefronts. That means there's no joy for PS4 or Xbox One owners. When is the Need for Speed Unbound release date? Racers don't need to wait long to play Need for Speed Unbound. The game's very first public showing revealed its launch date just a few months away. Need for Speed Unbound is set to be released on December 2, 2022. Anyone who's subscribed to EA Play will get access to a 10-hour demo a few days earlier, on November 29th. What are the need for Speed Unbound platforms? Bad news if you're using a last-generation console, Need for Speed Unbound will only be playable on the latest hardware. It hits PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X s and PC simultaneously. Publisher EA says it will target 4K resolution at 60fps at launch. On top of all the wild visual effects going on, it's not too surprising that only current-gen hardware can cut it. Is there a Need for Speed Unbound trailer? So far, there are two trailers for Need for Speed Unbound. The game was announced with a reveal trailer that showed off its new visual direction and a hint of its soundtrack in October 2022. Just a week later, the Need for Speed Unbound gameplay trailer debuted on Twitter. This brief video offers a better look at the racer in action and shows off some of the street art-inspired driving effects you can use to customize your car. What is Need for Speed Unbound gameplay like? Like other recent games in the series, Need for Speed Unbound takes place on a street racing circuit, where you'll need to win races and avoid cops looking to bus drivers. The story mode takes place in Lakeshore, a fictional version of Chicago. You play as an up-and-coming street racer who starts climbing the ranks to win back a priceless car after it's stolen from your family's auto shop. In addition to its single-player campaign mode, Need for Speed Unbound features multiplayer races and a mode called Takeover Scene. The full details of Takeover Scene haven't been revealed yet, but EA describes it as a new replayable precision driving mode. The mode will challenge drivers to take over certain parts of the city, and it's said to focus on tricky driving more than just winning races. Takeover Scene is hosted by an in-game version of rapper ASAP Rocky, who also appears on the soundtrack. Need for Speed Unbound's most notable new feature comes from its unique art style. Skillful driving and pulling off maneuvers like jumps and near misses will provide power that you can use to boost your speed. Each time you use a boost, it also triggers stylish visual effects that explode around your car. Colored exhaust, neon lights, and bold decals fill the screen with a style that looks like graffiti or some of the gorgeous animation from Into the Spider-Verse. Need for Speed Unbound Gameplay EA is leaning in on car customization for Unbound, but also introducing a whole new style and look, taking inspiration from street art and graffiti. You'll be able to customize not just your car's bodywork and tuning, using underlighting and body kits, but also the cartoony effects that surround it at key moments. While you can turn these off if you want a pure racing look, these larger-than-life effects can be another layer of personalization to make you stand out when you race online. Like Need for Speeds of old, there will still be cop chases to maneuver through, and you can bet before races if you want to take home some extra pay, and it's all about working your way up the street racing ranks. You can check out the game's full map on the official site here, to get a look at where you'll be racing. It's a big open world from the looks of things, with a nice balance between tight city streets and more open, sweeping mountain roads. In fact, it's a pretty clear throwback to the halcyon days of Need for Speed Underground 2 or Most Wanted in our books. You're able to unlock and choose which effects you want for your car, 
along with typical customizations like car wraps and other parts, or you can turn off the flashy new effects entirely if you just want to focus on the road. Your character is also customizable with outfits and other cosmetic effects. EA says new content will be added to Need for Speed Unbound for free after the game's launch, but hasn't shared any further details yet.